Good morning from the Badlands National Park, South Dakota. It's uh, Thursday already. We're on mountain time. So one, uh, one hour earlier than Oklahoma there, central time. A little hazy, they said, from the fire still. Hopefully uh, it'll clear out. There's astronomy uh, uh, kind of sep seminar at night, nine o'clock. I'd like to go to if it clears up. If it doesn't, maybe tomorrow. So we got uh, the bathrooms right there. Uh, showers are to the right. These are nice sites. They're pull, pull up, pull through, and uh, they're quite nice. We have electric, no water, no sewer, but they have water right across the road here. They could fill up some containers. We we filled up with some water at their main uh, water fill station there. They have these nice little shelters here. Nice cool breeze. Good morning. Did you did you do okay last night? Oh yes, yeah, slept nice. Great. Nice and quiet here. Spaces are pretty far apart. Yeah, it is a lot quieter. Uh, yeah, we were over there at uh, Oshkosh for over a week, and uh, we were in a 24-hour generator section. And man, some of those people ran those generators all night, 24/7. Even if it was cool. They ran their generators, probably to watch TV. They have a nice couple here. Uh, just went full time. Uh, he's a uh, retired, uh, retired physician. They bought this Airstream, brand new, ordered it in January and just got it about nine days ago. So they're making a loop through the West here. They have a YouTube channel called Riveting Adventures, but he said there's others that have that same name. So he actually gave me a super long code. And uh, they, do, they did quite well on their first few videos. Like I said on my Facebook post, what this reminds me of is sand castles and sculptures on the on the sand on, uh, along the beach that waves came up and eroded and uh, it's, uh, it is really something to see now yeah, it gives you a little sign that we're in a desert environment We plan on doing a, little, a few hikes, easy hikes, and then there's a drive, uh, loop of dr uh, loop drive through this whole area. There's a little town just two miles from here called Interior, South Dakota. Went there last night. There's a little grocery store. I think just one little bar restaurant. Also, there's the lodge just up the road here. Uh, in fact, I don't know if you could see right there are some cabins, the roofs of some of their cabins. They have a very nice gift store and camp store. Last night uh, there was a gust of wind that uh, really shook our RV. 
but it uh, didn't last very long and then died down. But it made me a little uneasy because reading some of the reviews from last month, uh, they had winds of up to 75, 80 miles per hour here. In fact, somebody posted a picture that uh, a pop-up had rolled over. Our gas mileage... Uh, dipped a bit because we were fighting a, a little crosswind headwind there well thanks for watching that's it for now hope you all have a great day and we'll talk to you later